St. Louis police are trying to figure out how a piece of debris on I-64 ended up flying through a woman's windshield while she was driving, killing her. Investigators released this picture of the debris, which appears to have come off another vehicle. Fox 2's Jordan Williams talks with an expert about the dangers of waste on roadways for drivers. Mark Arshashevsky at Metropolitan Glass Company in Florissant has seen it all. If something's going to come off, fly off a truck, if somebody's carrying something and something falls off the truck and then hits the ground, and then the next thing you know, it starts getting shot around. He's been fixing cracked and broken windshields due to debris for years. So when he heard the news of a woman being killed because of highway debris. But not surprised, no. It's a shame. This is the debris that flew through a woman's windshield Tuesday afternoon, killing her on Interstate 64. If somebody's driving on the highway, say, even it's at 65, 70 miles an hour, and if something comes shooting off of off another, if it kicked up off a tire, that may become about the same amount of speed. You got about, about 140 mile an hour impact. When taking a look at all these windshields, you may think one may offer a better form of protection than another. But Arshashevsky says when you're driving, your best form of safety is just being aware of your surroundings. They're all the same. You just got to watch where you're going. Stay out of a lot of times I tell people, especially if they get a lot of rock chips and that, I tell them stay out of the fast lane because that's where a lot of the debris hangs over towards the, the fast lane. The St. Louis Metropolitan Police Department is yet to identify the woman who was killed. Investigators are still trying to find out where exactly that piece of debris came from. In Florissant, Jordan Williams, Fox 2 News.